developing right now. People living below dams in both Oklahoma and Arkansas watch anxiously as the Army Corps of Engineers opens floodgates to release some of that high water. Two Works for You reporter Jeremy Mohue spoke with engineers on what to expect. Major storms have passed here in green country. Now many are left to deal with the aftermath of flash floods. Along with the help of the Army Corps of Engineers, the Grand River Dam Authority will continue to release water on Lake Hudson. However, just because the rain has gone away doesn't mean the work is done. Right now we're, you know, we have a lot of water coming into to Grand Lake and then, it, then we have to open up and it flows into Lake Hudson <clears throat> and then we open that one up and it flows into to Fort Gibson and we have to pass that on down the river. So Fort Gibson will be uh, the next one and all three of those probably by uh, Tuesday or Wednesday will probably be at one point or another 100% full. The Corps has estimated they'll release more than a million gallons of water by the end of the day. Download the Two Works For You mobile app to find out what's happening in your area. In East Tulsa, Jeremy Mohue, Two Works For You.